Hello, my beautiful bitter roots, and guess what time it is? Trace time! I love this box. We'll just see what kind of snackies. This is the only box that my daughter does not join with me for the unboxing because um, if my kids see this, they'll eat it all. And then mommy won't have any fun snacks to eat. And I eat one of these little, there's eight little things in here. I eat one a day. Um, I love, I get a lot of healthy snacks and stuff for me, but my kids love them too. So the second they find them, they're gone. They're just gone. So I have to be sneaky and hide stuff around the house. You know how you see some people hiding their candy and stuff like that from their kids? I don't have to worry about candy and stuff. It's my healthy snacks I have to hide from my kids. So, so anyway, look at the little leaves on here. Isn't that just festive? I like it. If I could open this up. Ooh, pop, ooh, ooh, okay. So, here's the box. And it's got pumpkins on the inside of the lid. And then, DIY pumpkin spiced lattes. And it's got DIY pumpkin spiced lattes. And it's got the ingredients for it. Yum! You know, a lot of people are not into like the pumpkin spice things. I do like pumpkin spice. Um, I'll drink it. It's not like my number one favorite that I'll go out and get. But I do enjoy it. I really do enjoy pumpkin flavored stuff. I, I can a lot of fruit butters and stuff. And one of my favorite things to can is pumpkin butter. It's literally like pumpkin pie on your English muffin. So good. That's what I had this morning, by the way. I had Thomas's pumpkin spiced English muffins, and then I put my pumpkin butter over the top, and I'm just like, oh, you good. We've got some share. Enter the code Zelma K 52 b and you will get your first and fifth boxes free. I don't know if you can see that. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. So I am totally going to try this. Ingredients, exp espresso, two shots, milk, a half a cup, pumpkin puree, three tablespoons, maple syrup, one tablespoon, which I do, I've got maple syrup. My husband's from Wisconsin, so when we went there this last June, um, we brought home a gallon of maple syrup from his mom's farm. Um, Mixed spice, cinnamon, nutmeg, and cardamom. It's one fourth uh, teaspoon. Vanilla extract, two drops. Um, and then whipped cream and cinnamon for the topping. And it just, here, I'll just hold this up so you guys can pause to get the directions. Because I want to share that with you guys too. Okay. Oh. Okay, it's looking yummy. Look what's in there so far. Okay, where do I want to start? Let's start with the nuts. Because they always give me fruit and nuts, and I don't know what they're trying to tell me. I do you. Ooh, big, huge Brazil nuts. Okay. These are non salted. Red skin peanuts, almonds, Brazil nuts, and pecans. Mmm, I love Brazil nuts. 240 calories. But they're good calories. I mean, they're just nuts. They're just nuts. Mm -hmm. Super forest fruits. Blueberries. Lingonberries. What's that? I don't think we have lingonberries here in Montana. Soft apple pieces and cherry raisins. It's these little itty bitty. Ooh, they're tart. Ooh, I like that. Look at these. Mmm. I like those. Lincoln Mary's, I like you. You're new and I like you. Okay. That package is 80 calories. This next one I'm coming up is 80 calories. This one's got mini strawberries, soft apple pieces, and black currants. And I've had their dried strawberries before. But I don't know if I tried any of the currants. Maybe I have. 
I love this dried strawberries, by the way, in this pack. I've had them before, and I love them. Mm. Okay, now we're getting into the bottom. Now these are the... This is Maple Pecan Granola Topper. And I've had one of their Apple Cinnamon Granola Toppers, I want to say. I don't eat a pecan. Ooh, that's extra crunchy. This whole thing is 140 calories. I love to add this on top of my um, Greek yogurt. Southern Barbecue Pistachios. I love pistachios. This is 110 calories for this pack. Let's see if I can find that one that's open. That I can easily open. There we go. Mmm. Mmm. Barbecue flavored pistachios. I like you. I like you. That was good. Okay. Then I have olive and rosemary bruschetta. And it's got olive croutons, rosemary, and garlic cashews. And I love their, their flavored cashews. Um, rosemary and garlic cashews. I have not tried that, but I've tried other garlic ones. And their lime chili cashews are so good. And then tomato baguette. Okay, first of all, the one thing I know I'm gonna love. Mmm. 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 -hmm. Yes. You can really taste the rosemary. Try crouton. Okay, going from the cashew to the crouton, there's not much flavor. <laughs> and then the, the tomato. That tastes like straight up tomato. There's like very little salt on it. That's good though. Mm. I like this. You stay out of my nuts. Those are mine, Malachibes. <laughs> He's licking his drops. They're mine. I gotta move them. I gotta move them. Because Mr. Malachi. They're mine. No, you can't have the pistachio shells either. Dog. Okay, so this I was looking up, 120 calories. Excuse you, rude much. Okay, smoky tomato, tomato, tomato. I don't. I always say tomato, and I don't know why I just said tomato. Who does? Tapenade or tapenade with aged cheddar biscuits. With sea salt, garlic, and chipotle. Mm. Only 90 calories. Yes, please. Ooh, that smells good. Mmm, smells good. I'll just take a little piece of this. Mmm. -hmm. nice kick to it this is really good okay so far my favorite thing in the box this is yum oh my goodness and I think right now you can order a box of just your favorites like one item and you'll get eight of those this is really good that is so good I don't want to put it down. I want to keep eating it. I just... I'm giving it the look. Because I want to eat it. Okay. We'll go on to the last one that I saved to the side. Because we've got to have dessert last. Unless you're my husband who has to eat dessert first. Okay. Multigrain. Banana caramel dippers. Banana shortbread and caramel sauce. Caramel sauce. And this is 150 calories. I'm going to try a little bit, but then save the rest for dessert or something. <laughs> I smelled this banana shortbread, and the first thing that came to mind was the banana runs. Because that's what it smells like. Just straight up banana runs. Oh my goodness, that brings me back to childhood. Do they even still make runs? Can anybody tell me if they still make runs?
but it's like eating a banana runt cookie with caramel sauce. That is just kind of throwing me off a bit. Kind of weird. It's kind of weird. But I can't complain because I asked him not to put any soy in there. There's nothing in here with soy. So that's always a bonus because autoimmune disease, diseases, you can't have soy. Just can't have soy. And I'm going to be finishing off this because this is, oh, this is good. And only 90 calories for something this good. This is like sinful. Sinful, it's so good. Okay. My favorite. My least favorite of the bunch. So, thank you guys for joining me. I will talk to you guys later and see you guys in my next video. Bye.